How does en engagement and excellence contribute to the development of our culture? You know, I think anybody who calls themselves an artist, whether you're doing comedy or music or film or whatever, you all, you're always trying to outdo yourself. You're always trying to do better than what you did last time. Uh, I mean, it's an impossible task. You, you know, we fail more often than we succeed, but that's what the, the goal always is. And I think the thing about arts and culture, like arts, the kind of th thing that I do is, is a popular culture. And it, but it's kind of like the air people breathe. It's the atmosphere you grow up in. I mean, kids, um, you know, I've, I, I can't tell you how many, I, hundreds of, of people have told me over the years how they grew up watching, listening to us on the radio or watching us on television. And I think that's a very important but often unacknowledged part of what culture is. It's, it's, it's what you breathe, watch, experience when you're growing up. And by the time you're you know, 20 years old, you have become a Quebecois or a Canadian or a, I don't know, a, a Winnipegger or something because of the environment you grew up in. And the arts are, are part of that environment. And I think without the arts, we don't have a culture because it's, it, that's what it is. You know, it, the culture is, the, is the, uh, the newspaper you pick up, it's the song you listen to on the radio, it's, it's all around you. And uh, the arts are what make it happen. It's not, it's not engineering that makes it happen or science that makes it happen, it's the arts. And what is the best advice you ever got from someone in your career? <laughs> <laughs> oh gee, I don't know, but the best advice I got. Um, I think, well, there were a couple times when I was, I was considering leaving, quitting, because I wanted, what I really wanted to do was go sailing around the world. And I was uh, talked out of it uh, twice. And uh, uh, I think that was probably as far as my career goes, the best advice I had, don't quit. <laughs> and what would be the advice you would give to a young one who enters in that field? Um, I, would, I would say, really don't think about the big picture. Just think about today. Think about, when you get up in the morning, think about what do I want to do today? If I want to, whatever your field is, and just do it. You know, like just do it, like Nike. But, but that's what you should do. Because I found out over, over the years that if you, if you worry about the days or t and take care of them, the years take care of themselves. So. I would, you know, if you want to be a comedian, be a comedian. And don't worry about making money. Just do the best you can at that, because you'll, if you don't, you'll always regret not having tried it.